Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Good morning everybody How are you today? I hope you are fine and keep healthy Okay My name is Fitriani And in this opportunity I will discuss about traditional learning And online learning I will discuss what is the meaning of traditional learning, what is the meaning of online learning, what the advantages and disadvantages of online learning and traditional learning, and what the differences between traditional learning and online learning. So, keep enjoy in my presentation. The traditional learning is one method of the education that include the regular attendance in classes, the interaction between student and teacher at their own class, and maintain discipline by following a schedule on campus or school and enhance the student's fitness as well as mental alertness. Online learning or e-learning is online education involves taking course in on the internet. Uh, the flexibility and confidence uh, provide an opportunity for student by allowing them to read their at their own pace without following a strict schedule. advantages of traditional learning uh, the advantages of traditional learning uh, maybe the first is experience of different campus activities traditional learning provides several types uh, of experience like clubs uh, sport activities communal activities life seminars and lab presentation or um, eating in canteen or etc and the second is develop a fast network the physical presence uh, provides interaction between student and teachers uh, moreover you can uh, meet a number of people like old students you can establish a large network which helps in gaining the personality and knowledge and the third is get facilities for different activities you will get the related equipment and other facilities required for your course in classroom learning the traditional classroom learning provides an approach of interaction among the student and teachers by raising the hands, asking questions, discussing a, a certain topics, giving a presentation, and etc. But the traditional learning have the, the advantages, uh, for example, like uh, because the rigid schedules in college and university make uh, the student more difficult to the study. Uh, the students have to organize their regular class based on the timetable and need to follow the attendance. Um, the students are mandated to the school and they don't have the chance to express their uh, skills. Okay, next with uh, the advantages of online learning. The first is flexible. We can learn online uh, courses even if uh, we are at home or work workplace. Flexible learning allows learners to complete their assigned projects at their own pace. A person can able to participate from anywhere with a good internet connection. 
The second is learning time. We will be able to learn more skills online to keep up with the market through online learning. The online learning provides a convenient way to obtain homework, exam, test scores, and many more within a phase of time. It allows the learning in a distance or disadvantaged uh, location. The e-learning course uh, take less class time than uh, traditional learning. The third is instructional materials. An online learner can get the course materials by an instructor in, in the forms uh, visual like a powerpoint presentation text format video format or true video on audio lectures but online learning have this advantage too uh, you won't be able to search of students reunions and rectional centers online education is not applicable to medical institution online learning provides you the limited option for a career and won't give experience of college life so the differences between traditional learning and online learning you can conclude from my explanation uh, maybe you the first is uh, the traditional learning is not flexible and online learning is flexible traditional learning is using by face to face with teachers and direct interaction with teachers but the online learning is by using internet and indirect interaction so maybe that's all of my presentation uh, thank you for your attention and i'm sorry for my mistake wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh